I'm absolutely delighted that you and uh, Aubrey are so happy together. Oh, yes, it must be in the air. Don't be surprised if you hear wedding bells for Kelly soon. With who? With John McBain? No, I can't be serious. And why, Joe, would you care? Hang in there, all right? Ambulance is here. You're almost to the hospital. Yeah, standing by. We're going to keep pressure on it. We won't make it to the ER. No, I, I just can't believe John would, would move on to somebody else so soon. I mean, just a couple of months ago, he's right where he was getting ready to marry Natalie. Some people move quickly. I gotta take these to my wife. Hmm. Ooh. Speaking of people moving quickly, I think you've got some competition. Look who's moving in on. Oh, my. Jessica. Uh, Joey, this is, um. <clears throat> Wes. This is the old man? Yes, Joey and I are married. Happily? In there, sweetheart. This one can get you in the ambulance, okay? Don't go. I'm not leaving you. I'm gonna get the car right behind the ambulance and meet you at the hospital. Okay, let's go! Come on! What did that in a real white blade? I think it was a kitchen knife. She's gonna make it. The pretty deep wounds. She's making it. Go. It's McBain, all right? Give me every available unit and a CSU team to the Angel Square Hotel. Put on APB for Marty Saber. Consider her armed and dangerous. Ian, you look pretty single before your husband showed up. Joey and I are very happily married. I'm not trying to mess up your thing here. It's just, it's been a while, you know? Seems like all the good ones are married. Yes, uh, I'm too old for you, and I'm married. A bummer. Hey, can we get some drinks over here, or what? Working on it. No, Christian. Uh, no matter what uh, she or he are saying, do not give her liquor. I know, I know. That's why I'm taking my time with the drinks. Do you think that Vicky knows about this, this new altar? Wes? Exactly. I mean, if anybody knows how to handle the situation, it would be Vicky. I'm going to call her. Oh, ah. Mayor Dorian Lord here. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Come to the hospital now. What's wrong? Kelly's been hurt. What happened to her? Oh, my God. What? I'm on my way over. What are you doing? What's going on? It's Kelly. She's been brought by ambulance to the emergency room. She's been stabbed. Oh, my God. I'm going to go with you. What? Joey! Oh, I, I can't do that, okay? I got to go. Look, I got to go. Hey, can I get a drink over here or not? Are you all right? Yeah, whatever. We can deal with Wes. I wasn't talking about that, Wes. And I'm just... Aren't you concerned your husband ran off for, to his ex-wife? Why should I be? What do you got, Doc? We've called in a second surgical team. Uh, as soon as we can clear an OR, we'll take her up. Let's get her admitting bloods and find out if CT can take her on our way up. We need to know what we're dealing with before we go in. Okay. okay. I called Dorian. Thank you. You look like this, you look real pretty. You think you remember what happened? You said Marty did this to you? Wait for me. She was waiting for you in my room. Oh, I'm sorry. I was looking for John McBain's room. I didn't realize I walked into the Twilight Zone by mistake. It's not a joke, Kelly. We need to get a few things straight. Apparently, I didn't make myself clear in your office. I am with John now. said Marty was upset. She, she's crazy. She, she... I tried to calm her down. But she heard me. I heard you making fun of me, belittling me. Yeah, but you know what? John, he's just too nice to kick you out. He's too nice to tell you to your face that he's done with you. That he doesn't want you anymore. She wouldn't back down. That John is done with Natalie. John is done with Kelly. Because John's with me. Did she have a knife? 
No, I... I am just gonna go ahead. Come on! What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? You think you're gonna use that? You think you're gonna use that to get rid of me? Think again, baby. She, she went back down. She attacked me. I know what you're capable of. I can write a book, and I'm not gonna let you hurt me. She grabbed my knife. She, she pulled me into the bathroom. I started feeling all this pain. Okay, fine. You know what? That's enough, all right? That's that's plenty. No, no. You don't have to remember all this, all right? We know all this, okay? Hey, hey slow down. You just gotta take care of yourself, all right? Do you know where Marty went? Lieutenant, she needs her rest. No. I heard... What'd you hear? I heard someone coming. Who came in? Who was it? You heard someone come to the room. Who was it? Kelly, where is she? Doctors are working on her in there. Oh. What'd they say? Is she gonna be all right? I think so, but she lost four units of blood. Oh, dear God. Yeah, that's bad. And Marty Saybrook did this? That's what Kelly said. She was gone when I got there. Where, where did this happen? My place. Kelly had went over there and Marty was waiting. So you're the reason Kelly's in there? Joe. No, it's true. Marty never would have gone after Kelly if it wasn't for him. This isn't going to help. Kelly has to be all right. She has to be. I'm not worried about Joey and Kelly. He still cares about her. He's always been honest about that. And that makes it okay. They were married once. It says good things about him that he can still be friends with her. You don't believe a word of that. You don't know me anymore. I will always know you, Marty. This domestic goddess thing you got going on right now, it's not gonna last. Joey will figure it out if he hasn't already. So far, no sign of Dr. Saybrook. Expand the perimeter, right? Drop a net over the city if you have to, all right? Every bridge, every highway out of town. I'll clear it with the commissioner. Get a unit over to Landfair. Marty might go after Natalie Banks. You got my cell phone number? All right, I want you to check in every 15 minutes. Get everyone not working another case, get them in here tonight, all right? Everyone on the street until Marty Saybrook is in custody. All right, turn and burn, go. Doctor, how is she? Is she, she awake? She's stable. We're giving her blood transfusions now. As soon as the OR calls, we'll take her up. Can I see her? She's not conscious. I just want to be in there. Go ahead. I am going to need a full report. Mayor Lord. You can make that Dr. Lord a medical doctor so don't sugarcoat it. There are two abdominal stab wounds. We'll do a CT scan to get a better picture before we go to surgery. Given the blood loss, we could be looking at a grade two liver loss, or it could be the kidney. I'm out. Mm -hmm. What about you, Blondie? Your husband went AWOL. Let's say we teach him a lesson. <laughs> Thanks, but I'm sure he'll be back soon. Hmm? Ah, better be important. Leave a woman like you waiting. You gotta stick around, Cal. You know, because I can't picture a world without you. So, uh, so don't make me try. I... I don't know what I would do if you weren't in my life. 